Richard Branson had extraordinary ambitions from an early age. He grew up in a small village and had the heart to pursue his dreams from an early age. As a child, Branson played like his other children, but was always curious about the unknown, and is said to have dreamed of the future by looking up at the night sky. Branson's belief that, as Helen Keller once said, dreams are not dreamed, they are achieved, was deeply ingrained in Branson's heart. From an early age, he not only had a dream, but a passion to pursue it. His early vision was not in academics, but in business. Branson, who did not fit in at his school, pursued his own interests and talents, preferring practical experience to academics. Although he may not have achieved academic success, he instead found a platform for his unique perspective and creativity. As a young man, Branson was ready to jump into the unknown. The passion that continued to burn in his heart led him to an adventure of a different dimension. The words of the famous quarter Robert H. Schuller come to mind. Reality will never crush those who don't have dreams. Branson was determined to pursue his own dreams and turn them into reality. What can Branson's childhood story tell us? The importance of pursuing your dreams, the courage to learn from your mistakes, the courage to face challenges, and the sustained passion required to overcome challenges. His story gives us the courage to believe in our dreams and take on adventures into the unknown. Branson's decision to pursue business over academics stemmed from his inability to fit into traditional learning at school. He found his path early on and knew that it was in business. His academic results may not have been great, but he had a passion for bringing new ideas to life. During his school days, Branson was different from other students and was obsessed with trying new businesses. He was passionate about going beyond his textbooks and gaining real business experience. During this period, Branson must have kept Albert Einstein's words close to his heart. He said, the essence of learning is experience, and if you don't experience it, you can't learn anything. His first project as a student was the launch of a school magazine. This was the moment when his entrepreneurial spirit was born and he took his first steps. The words of Antoine de Saint-Exupéry fit perfectly with his attitude of pursuing his dreams without fear of failure. If you want to build a ship, don't make people carry wood, make them dream of the infinite sea. More than just a magazine, Branson's aspiration was to show people new oceans and make them aspire to their dreams. The magazine was a success, and Branson became even more passionate about business. His academic failures were the stairs to his success. His experience during this period produced what would become the foundation of the Virgin Group. What can this story teach us? It is the courage to move towards your dreams without being bound by failure or tradition. As the words of Einstein and St. Exupery demonstrate, learning comes from experience, and failure is also a part of success. Branson's entrepreneurial spirit gives us the courage to pursue our dreams and explore new horizons. Branson's foray into the music business stemmed from his deep love for music in his youth. One day he decided to start Virgin Records to share his music with others. William Ernest Henry's words are apt for this decision. The first step to success is to take a step toward your dream. Branson just took a bold step towards his dream. The founding of Virgin Records was the beginning of an adventure full of challenges. Initially starting out as a small studio, Branson believed in his own vision and was not afraid to take risks and take on bold projects. His faith and drive made him an important player in the music business. Napoleon Hill's quote, success is a choice, and choices are based on beliefs, symbolizes Branson's determination. Virgin Records took the music industry by storm with its unique style and approach, providing a new platform for artists. Branson understood that success has a lot to do with faith and choice, and the will to face challenges. An innovative and challenging approach has always been essential to Virgin Records' success. Brunson put Michael Jordan's words into practice. Failure is the mother of success, and success is the child of failure. He wasn't afraid to fail, finding his lessons each time and trying new ideas. His attitude supported the growth of Virgin Records and breathed new life into the music industry. There is much to learn from Branson's story. His venture into the music business shows that believing in his dreams and acting on his beliefs is the shortcut to success.
Like him, we too can pave the way to success by taking steps toward our dreams, facing difficulties, and always boldly taking on new challenges. His foray into aviation was born out of his adventurous spirit. From his experience in air travel, he sensed that better service and innovative approaches were possible. That belief led to the founding of Virgin Atlantic. Mikhail Gorbachev's words, believing in possibilities leads to great success symbolized Branson's sentiments. Founding Virgin Atlantic was a challenge that opened up new possibilities in the airline industry, and his conviction bore fruitful results. Virgin Atlantic's rise has been fascinating from its first flight. Branson put into practice Richard Branson's own words, let's do the unusual. Don't give ordinary service, let's offer surprise and excitement. He has led Virgin Atlantic to success by offering passengers new aviation experiences and unparalleled service and comfort. The saying failure is the key to success fits Branson's aviation adventure. Although we faced various difficulties in our first attempt, we learned from these mistakes, made improvements, and strive to provide even better services. His attitude is filled with the strength to not give in to setbacks and the passion to pursue his dreams. Branson's humanity and leadership were essential to Virgin Atlantic's success. He said, leadership is established by the actions you show, and he built trust by standing on the front lines and always working alongside his employees. Branson is an adventurer who is always willing to take on new challenges. His attitude echoes the words of Robert Goddard, dream boldly. Without boldness, dreams will never come true. His bold play has expanded the Virgin brand into diverse areas and carved a footprint into new markets. Virgin's diverse expansion is a direct result of Branson's unique vision and sense of adventure. Music, aviation, and now, space? That's right, Branson ventured into space through Virgin Galactic. His attitude resonates with the words of Elias Howe, people set their own limits. Limits do not exist for those who challenge them. This adventure into space opens us up to new possibilities and unknown worlds. It can be felt that Branson took to heart the words of John F. Kennedy, continuing to challenge your dreams opens new frontiers. His challenge gives us the courage to boldly pursue our dreams. Additionally, Virgin's brand extension is unique and diverse. Branson has expanded into new markets by living out Jerry Jerzinger's motto, do what your competitors won't do. For example, Virgin Group has expanded into the medical field through Virgin Healthcare. Meanwhile, Branson's vision is becoming increasingly diverse as Virgin Holidays expands into tourism. This diverse expansion speaks to the words of leadership expert John C. Maxwell, to be successful, you must be flexible. Branson is always flexible, open to new ideas, and open to change. There is a saying, failure is the key to success, and Branson put this into practice. A failure within the Virgin Group later became his management philosophy and the cornerstone of his success. An example of a failure is the Virgin Cola rollout. He launched his own beverage brand to compete with Coca-Cola and Pepsi. However, Competition in the market was fierce and success was not achieved. Because of this experience, Branson says, failure is just a step back, but an important step to move on. The attitude of learning from failure and moving on to the next challenge is in line with George Bernard Shaw's words, success is not final, failure is not fatal. The important thing is to keep trying. Branson saw failure not as an end, but as a new beginning, and was fearless in taking on the next adventure. The lessons learned from our failures have had a positive impact on the entire Virgin Group. This has enabled us to be more flexible and creative as an organization and better prepared for future challenges. The Virgin Group is not just a company, but a school of learning where we share our failures and successes and utilize the knowledge gained from those experiences to evolve. The lessons learned from Branson's failures have great implications for us as well. Challenges involve not only successes, but also failures. However, it is also an opportunity for growth and a clue to finding new possibilities. His words, success is not the last thing you laugh at, it is the first thing you laugh at has a deep lesson in it. We are constantly expanding into new fields and demonstrating a willingness to tackle social issues. 
one of the most notable moments was when he established the Virgin Green Fund to invest in green energy. This was the result of his serious consideration of environmental issues and his determination to make a difference through real action. Branson's words, all we can do now is start doing something for the future, express his commitment to the environment. Virgin Green Fund helps build a sustainable future by investing in renewable energy, energy efficiency, and green businesses. This approach echoes the words of Jane Goodall, our power lies in the small actions of each individual. Branson leveraged its position as a major company and believed in the potential for small individual actions to come together to create big changes. Branson's vision and leadership were essential to Virgin Green Fund's success. He chose to fulfill his social mission through environmental investments based on his belief that sustainable businesses succeed in the long run. This attitude suggests a new way of doing business, one in which companies should not only pursue profits, but also take responsibility for the global environment and society. His story gives us hope that the small actions of each person can have a big impact. It conveys the message that addressing environmental issues is our shared responsibility and that businesses must also play a major role in building a sustainable future. Virgin Antua is Branson's resort on the beautiful Caribbean island of Antigua, but that's not all. More than just tourism, Branson is also committed to giving back to the community and sustainable development. Branson's words, success is shared, and the success of others is your success, epitomize his attitude toward social mission. Virgin Antua aims to create a sustainable tourism industry, creating local jobs and respecting local culture and heritage. This initiative is an example of how Virgin Antua is having a positive impact on local communities. Branson said, successful companies need to contribute to their communities, not just pursue profits, and Branson's actions are true to his words. The case of Virgin Unchua symbolizes a new trend in business. Companies should be responsible to society and grow together. John Moulton's words, success lies in serving others, resonate with Branson's social vision. True success occurs when businesses serve society and contribute to the development of local communities. Virgin on Tour's success shows that it is win-win for companies to fulfill their social mission. Giving back to the local community will feed back to companies, and by growing together, we will build a more sustainable future. Branson's words, the best way to predict the future is to create an epitomized Virgin Group's vision. He is constantly venturing into unknown territory and pursuing innovative ideas to build a sustainable future. Virgin Group is now focused on promoting sustainable business. As part of this, we are embodying consideration for the global environment by actively investing in renewable energy and contributing to the environment and fulfilling our corporate social responsibilities. Branson's belief that success can only be achieved in partnership with local communities is deeply embedded in Virgin Group's business model. Virgin Group's business is driven by the recognition that a company's success does not occur in isolation and that collaboration with local communities is essential. Looking to the future, Virgin Group is moving towards new challenges. Branson says a new frontier awaits and is gearing up for his next adventure. His words embody the importance of taking on challenges and creating new possibilities, even in an ever-changing future. Virgin Group's future is based on new values, driving sustainable business. Branson emphasized the idea that business should not just pursue profits, but also consider the impact on society, and said that it is essential for the future of business for companies to proactively address social issues. I'm talking. The success of the Virgin brand is truly a result of leadership and vision. Branson said, to be successful, it is important to first make others happy, and the Virgin brand has grown together not only with customers, but also with employees and business partners. Building the Virgin brand is about more than just delivering products and services. This is rooted in the Virgin likeness that is consistently felt across different fields such as Virgin Atlantic, Virgin Mobile, and Virgin Holidays. Brands reach people, and consistency builds trust and creates fans. Branson's words, success is not the last thing you laugh at, but the first thing you laugh at, symbolize the origins of the Virgin brand. 
Since its inception, Virgin has always been unafraid to take risks, unbound by tradition, and constantly exploring new frontiers. This sense of adventure is what sets Virgin's brand apart. Perhaps the key to success is customer first. Branson has made customer satisfaction a top priority, adhering to the belief that we can't be happy unless our customers are happy. This is a major factor in building trust in the brand and is linked to success. The success of the Virgin brand is also due to the flexibility of the Virgin group as a whole. The flexibility to expand into new ideas and fields has given us a competitive advantage. Jerry Jerzinger's words, do what your competitors won't do, epitomize Virgin's commitment to challenge. More than just a corporate brand, the Virgin brand represents adventure, flexibility, and a commitment to customer care. Branson's words, do what you want to do, that's the best business strategy, illustrate his philosophy. Virgin is not just a company, it is a company that takes on new challenges, and it is this adventurous spirit that continues to capture people's hearts. Branson has great insight and flexibility when it comes to media strategy. He believes that the media is just part of the way to get people to know you and believe in you, and has actively promoted his personality and vision. As a result, his public image has become more than just a businessman and resonates with many people. As part of Branson's media strategy, he has actively communicated his sense of adventure and challenge. For example, his continued pursuit of space exploration and the Virgin Group's expansion into various new ventures are powerful ways to demonstrate his leadership and vision through the media. Branson believes that adventure is the shortcut to success, and by embodying his belief, he teaches others the importance of taking on challenges. Branson's leadership style goes beyond just business success and builds empathy and trust. He says, leadership begins with a heart of gratitude and words of encouragement, and he values active communication in order to build good relationships with employees and business partners. That attitude has forged strong bonds among those who support his leadership. Through the media, Branson candidly talks about the struggles and failures behind his success. He believes that failure is the basis of success, and it is the most valuable experience, and his attitude of turning failure into an opportunity arouses sympathy from many people. His leadership style is flexible and empathetic. He is always open to new ideas and challenges and loves working with his team to achieve results. This attitude makes him even more attractive as a leader. Finally, Branson's famous quote, the best way to succeed in business is to have fun, epitomizes his vision, media strategy, and leadership style. Creating empathy through fun and seeking challenge and adventure are key contributors to his success. Virgin Group's partnership strategy is attracting attention as a means of not only expanding its business, but also expanding into new areas and fostering innovation. Branson's belief that success requires collaboration with others is fundamental to Virgin's business model. When Virgin Group partners with major companies, we place great importance on ensuring that our values and missions match. For example, the partnership between Virgin Atlantic and Delta Airlines is the result of a shared goal of improving the user experience for both parties and strengthening their international roots. Branson's quote, success comes from partnerships, captures Virgin Group's commitment to partnering with other companies. This is not just about expanding your business, it is also about creating a fertile ground for new ideas and energy. Branson always upholds the slogan, challenge new frontiers, and opens up new possibilities for business through collaboration with other companies. Virgin Group also values flexibility when it comes to partnering. Branson believes that a company that cannot adapt to change will not survive and emphasizes the ability to adapt to change when working with business partners. This is one of the reasons why Virgin Group is successful in many areas. Success with our partners relies on mutual commitment to working towards a common goal. Virgin Group works with its partners to leverage each other's strengths to reach new markets and customer groups. Branson's words, partnership is born of mutual respect, demonstrate the importance of collaboration behind success. Branson saw space travel as a new business frontier, an area that was once thought of as a pipe dream or fantasy. 
He believed that pursuing your dreams is the only way to enrich your life, and he always kept his passion for space exploration close to his heart. Virgin Galactic is the embodiment of this passion. Branson founded Virgin Galactic, declaring, The time has come for us to go to space, and the time is now. This is the first step toward the future he dreamed of, and at the same time suggests new possibilities for us. Virgin Galactic is a bold project to bring space travel to the general public. Branson opened the door to space with his belief that space travel should be accessible to everyone, not just the elite. This is truly the embodiment of our mission to venture into unknown territory and provide new perspectives to humanity. Branson's passion for space is symbolized by the phrase, challenges lead us to greater heights. Never content with past successes, he has always sought new challenges. Space travel is one of the most difficult and rewarding challenges of all. Virgin Galactic brings us hope for a new future. Space travel has gone beyond a dream and is becoming a reality. Branson's words, in order to realize a dream, you must first take on a challenge speak to his passion for space and his attitude toward that challenge. Virgin Galactic's challenge means a lot to us as well. It is an adventure beyond limits and into unknown territory. Branson said, our future lies in space, and talked about the great possibilities that space travel brings to us. Branson has always had a curiosity and passion for new technology and has expanded future possibilities by connecting this to business. Notable among these is our investment in a next-generation transportation system called Hyperloop. Hyperloop is a futuristic means of transportation in which ultra-high-speed capsules pass through vacuum tubes to move people and goods at incredible speeds. Branson's belief that change is born from challenge is behind this challenging project. He believes that technology and business are inseparable and believes that investing in advanced technologies like Hyperloop is the key to unlocking new possibilities for business. The Hyperloop project is also attracting attention from the perspective of investing in the future. Branson says, to create the future, we must combine today's technology and business, and he looks to the transformation of the future while leveraging modern technology. The saying behind his investments is, chasing your dreams is the most exciting and meaningful adventure you can have. The Hyperloop truly plays a role in realizing the dreams of humankind and is part of the adventure that will open up the future through the fusion of technology and business. His passion for new technology has the potential to not only change the future of transportation, but to revolutionize society as a whole. If the Hyperloop becomes a reality, the concepts of time and distance will change and people's lives will become more efficient and enriched. With his belief that the future is born from the ideas of today, Branson is always willing to invest in new technology. He also says, failure is a staircase to success and believes that working on challenging projects can lead to success. Failure always follows behind success. Branson believes that failure is the shortest path to success, and as he says, he has faced various difficulties and failures while taking on bold projects. However, the lessons he learned there led to his next adventure. One big lesson is that failure is not the end goal, but a process of growth and learning. Branson says, behind every success, there are many setbacks, and his attitude that true success comes from setbacks is leading him to his next challenge. Another important lesson from his failure is the importance of flexibility and adaptability. If a project failed, I didn't dwell on it and instead looked for new directions and ideas. Branson believes that failure is the key to opening new doors, and his flexible thinking in the face of challenges has led him to new adventures. Branson's aircraft project was emblematic of the company's comeback from failure. The bold plan to create Virgin Atlantic Global Flyers has been forced to cancel after encountering technical problems. However, he accepted his failure and continued to evolve into new projects such as space travel and Hyperloop. One of his most inspirational quotes is, The most important thing is to get up and move forward. This represents his attitude of rising up from failure and moving forward. It embodies the belief that not giving up even when you fail, overcoming adversity and moving on to the next adventure will pave the way to success. His adventurous spirit and positive attitude are a source of motivation for us. 
Failure is a part of life, and overcoming it will open up new possibilities. What we learn from Branson's journey is that the strength and flexibility to face adversity and overcome failure are the shortcuts to success. Leadership is essentially the ability to bring people together and move toward a common goal. Branson says, leadership begins with inspiring and empowering people. One episode that embodies this philosophy is the failure and restart of his aircraft project. Virgin Atlantic Global Flyers has been forced to cancel due to technical issues. But Brunson showed the essence of his leadership, telling his team, the most important thing is to get up and move on. The team resonated with these words and successfully made a comeback, gaining even more energy for their next new adventure. One of his leadership principles is to take care of his employees. Branson believes that if our employees are not happy, our customers cannot be happy either, and we have created a work environment that is close to our employees. This is what drives Virgin Group to build a culture of excellence. He also says, setting bold goals and pursuing them is an important element of leadership. Bold goals provide the driving force to venture into unknown territory, providing opportunities for the entire team to grow and discover new possibilities. In terms of motivation principles, Branson recognizes the importance of respecting the individual dreams and aspirations of employees and incorporating them into the company's vision. When employees are passionate about their work and willing to take on challenges, they become the force that moves the entire organization forward. The words never forget that you are a human being before you are a manager symbolized Branson's leadership philosophy. He constantly communicates with his employees, teaching them the importance of laughing and crying together and moving forward as a team. Leadership is also about transmitting positive energy. Branson says, positive energy energizes employees and the business, and there is always a bright and positive atmosphere around him. Branson's leadership is a perfect blend of team building and motivation principles. His words and actions show employees new possibilities and give them the power to turn challenges into positive energy. Branson's leadership philosophy is a treasure trove of learning for us as well. Caring for your employees, challenging yourself to bold goals, and projecting positive energy are the ingredients of true leadership and will drive your organization to success. I have always had an adventurous spirit and have always taken on bold projects. However, behind the success were many failures. The most emblematic of these is the failure of the Virgin Atlantic Global Flyers aircraft project. This project had to be canceled due to technical problems. But Branson saw that failure not just as an end, but as a new beginning. He said, the most important thing is to get up and move forward again, and he made the decision to head out on his next adventure with his team. His approach to failure was to see it as an opportunity to learn and grow, not just a setback. He believes that failure is the shortest path to success, and the lessons learned from failure will lead to his next adventure. One of those lessons is the importance of flexibility and adaptability. Remaining persistent in the face of failure and exploring new directions and ideas were the keys to Branson's path to success. In his words, failure is the key to opening new doors. He recognizes failure as an opportunity to open up new possibilities. Branson also says, challenges are the most exciting and meaningful adventures. He is not afraid of failure. Rather, he sees it as preparation for the next challenge. For him, failure is an important step toward paving a new path. His recovery from failure was symbolized by the space travel business he launched after his aircraft project. After overcoming the failure of his aircraft project, he took on a new dream. The success of space travel was proof that learning from failure and having a positive attitude lead to the next adventure. Branson's way of dealing with failure has great implications for us as well. The attitude of not being afraid of failure and seeing it as an opportunity for growth and learning will transform into the ability to open up new possibilities. His adventurous spirit and positive energy give us the courage and hope to take on new challenges. Behind every success is a life full of challenges and continuous learning. He believes that business and personal growth are inseparable, and this mindset is the cornerstone of his success. One iconic episode occurred when his company, Virgin Group, faced failure in an aircraft project. 
After the setback, Branson said, failure is the shortest path to success and accepted it as a lesson for his next challenge. Despite his failures, he fostered business and personal growth through constant learning and improvement. Branson believes that success is always a process and believes that the process of moving toward a goal itself produces results. Flexibility and innovation are also key to growing his business. Being open to new ideas and technology is what makes Virgin Group so successful. Branson says, change is inevitable in business, but embracing it and being flexible is the key to success. His approach is also remarkable, not only in business, but also in personal growth. He values work-life balance and believes that happy individuals are successful. As part of this, Branson has incorporated a sense of adventure into his daily life, blending work and play. For example, his Virgin Group office is equipped with a pool table and jacuzzi, allowing employees to relax between work. This embodies his belief that it is important to have fun at work and has contributed to Virgin Group's continued success. Branson's continued success is driven by a passion for purpose, learning from failure, flexibility and innovation, and the importance of having fun at work. These elements form his management philosophy and are the source of Virgin Group's continued growth despite numerous challenges. In addition to being a successful entrepreneur, Branson has inspired many people with his outstanding leadership. One example of his leadership was his recovery from the failure of Virgin Group's aircraft project. When the aircraft project failed, many criticisms and accusations were leveled at him. However, Branson instead embraced that failure and saw it as a door to new possibilities. True to his saying, failure is the shortest path to success, he and his team made a comeback and showed the courage to move on to the next adventure. His leadership is always visionary. Branson says, to be successful, it's important to remain bold. He positioned Virgin Group not just as a company, but as a community of adventure and innovation, and his vision spread throughout the organization. Branson also values his connections and uses his influence to create social change. For example, at Virgin Atlantic, employees actively contribute to their local communities by participating in individual projects. This is part of the social impact of his leadership. Branson believed that success comes from contributing to the well-being of others, and he shared the joy of Virgin Atlantic's success. This attitude is coupled with the deep humanity of his leadership. His famous quote is, The pursuit of bold goals is a key element of leadership. Bold goals grow individuals and organizations, and challenges become the driving force for success. And his influence extends beyond business to philanthropy. When Virgin Atlantic was hit hard by hurricanes in the Caribbean, Branson supported local communities by donating millions of dollars to recovery efforts. Branson's leadership excellence is rooted in vision and reach. He has demonstrated the ability to face not only successes, but also setbacks and difficulties with a positive attitude and overcome them. His attitude has inspired many people and his leadership is seen as a role model. In addition to being a successful businessman, Branson also devotes a lot of energy and passion to philanthropy. As part of this, he is active in community service through Virgin Anchua. A few years ago, a Category 5 hurricane struck the Caribbean, and Antigua and Barbuda was also affected. This disaster left many people homeless and caused devastating damage to basic infrastructure. At this time, Branson recognized the urgent need to support local communities through Virgin Anchua. He launched a recovery support project in partnership with a charity organization based on his belief that while business is successful, it is essential that that success be returned to the local community. This was the moment when his vision became more than just corporate social responsibility. Virgin Antua's support was wide-ranging and ranged from rebuilding homes to rebuilding schools and improving medical facilities. Under his guidance, Virgin Antua employees worked with local communities and worked together to rebuild. Branson says, success comes from contributing to the happiness of others. True to its words, Virgin Antua's philanthropic activities are not just about support, but also a demonstration of empathy and cooperation with local communities.
This was the moment when his influence transcended corporate boundaries and demonstrated his ability to move people's hearts. His bold and positive attitude has led to success in his philanthropic endeavors. He says, giving is one of the most rewarding things you can do, and he shows us that successful businesses are truly successful when they give back to the community. His actions went beyond social responsibility and created a sense of mission to serve others. Virgin Antua's recovery efforts are more than just philanthropy. They are a demonstration of the profound impact that empathy and cooperation can have on local communities. Branson's philanthropy also has many lessons for us. His humanitarian work is driven by his belief that a successful business's contribution to the community is part of true success. More than just a successful businessman, Branson's legacy is marked by a passion for challenge, adventure, and social contribution. At the heart of his legacy is his belief that pursuing dreams and taking on bold challenges is at the heart of his life. As a young man, he started out as an entrepreneur, and while achieving success in the business world, he bravely faced failures and challenges. For example, the lessons learned from the failure of Virgin Group's aircraft project were a source of strength and flexibility for him in the face of adversity. He said, failure is the shortest path to success, which later became the cornerstone of his business philosophy. True to his words, his legacy is engraved with stories of joy and growth where setbacks lead to success. Branson's legacy also includes pioneering business endeavors. He expanded into various fields and not only succeeded, but also opened up new markets. His ventures with Virgin Records, Virgin Atlantic Airways, and space travel are a testament to his commitment to constantly venturing into the unknown and pushing the envelope. This attitude teaches us that thinking outside the box and boldly taking on unknown adventures is the key to innovation and success. The Virgin Group he built, with a diverse portfolio of businesses, reflects his business philosophy and the strength of his leadership. And while Branson enjoyed his success, he was also active in giving back to his community and the environment. Hurricane recovery efforts and environmental initiatives through Virgin Unchua are part of his social responsibility and form part of his legacy. His famous quote is, Business is a means of serving society, and success comes from contributing to the well-being of others. As this quote suggests, his legacy is a remarkable blend of business and social responsibility. Branson's legacy will serve as a guide for future entrepreneurs and business leaders. His true legacy will be in pursuing his dreams, facing challenges, and enjoying his successes while giving back to society. While he is a successful businessman, he values family ties and believes in creating harmony between work and personal life. This belief stems from an episode from his youth. In his youth, immersed in business success, one day he realized that he lacked time with his family. Sensing that his passion for work could conversely undermine his relationship with his family, he began his efforts to restore balance to his life. This turning point became the background for his famous quote, Success is not everything in life, but valuing time with family is true wealth. He has achieved a more fulfilling life by balancing work and private life and valuing communication with his family. As part of that, Branson likes to share his business successes with his family and take on adventures with them. For example, when Virgin Atlantic was launched, he found a way to enjoy both success and family bonding, such as accompanying his family on the first flight. This commitment to his family also had a positive impact on his business. His strong ties with his family have provided him with spiritual support and have had a positive impact on his work. Branson also says, success lies in being in harmony with the elements of happiness, such as family, friends, and health. This quote shows that he associates success not just with business results, but with lifelong satisfaction and happiness. His story teaches us that even in success, valuing family ties can help build a more meaningful and fulfilling life. Commitment to family is the key to achieving both success and happiness at the same time. From a young age, he believed that if I don't have fun, I don't do it, and he has carried that attitude into his business and adventures. His famous quote, success must be achieved while having fun, symbolizes his philosophy. 
one of the most obvious moments of his adventurous spirit was the founding of Virgin Atlantic Airways. At that time, it was extremely risky to take on the airline industry, which was dominated by major airlines. But Branson believed that only by taking risks could new possibilities be discovered, so he boldly founded his own airline. At that time, his family joined him on his first flight, showing that they were enjoying the adventure of success. This adventurous side has contributed greatly to Virgin Atlantic's success. His nickname, Sky High Billionaire, refers to Virgin Galactic, the company he founded to fulfill his dreams of space. His venture into space travel was the moment his adventurous spirit reached new heights. Branson says, success is only meaningful when you have fun, and pursuing adventure is the key to building a rich life. His adventurous side teaches him the importance of seeing work not just as a duty, but as part of a life full of fun and a passion for adventure. His passion for adventure is deeply rooted in his success. Whether it was his business ventures or his venture into space, he kept his fun and adventurous spirit intact and achieved great success as a result. This story teaches us that success is something to be enjoyed and pursued, and that embracing a sense of adventure is the key to a more fulfilling life. Branson's adventurous side gives us the courage and joy to pursue unknown possibilities. The foundation of Branson's philosophy is the belief that success means nothing unless you enjoy it. Since his youth, he is focused on having fun in both his work and his adventures. Among them, the story of his entry into the aviation industry symbolizes his philosophy. At that time, the airline industry was dominated by major corporations, making it difficult for new entrants to enter. But Branson founded Virgin Atlantic not just for business, but for adventure and fun. His philosophy of success became clear the moment he took his first flight with his family. He said, success is meaningless unless it is based on enjoyment, and these words speak volumes about his approach to life and work. His success is not just business success, but is connected to the joy and enjoyment of life as a whole. Additionally, Branson's philosophy is based on the idea that failure is the basis of success. When his aircraft project failed, he took it as an experience and moved on with his next adventure. This positive approach helped pave the way for his success. His lifestyle philosophy also focuses on a balance between work and private life. He has pursued success and happiness at the same time by valuing his family and sharing fun and adventure through work. This is why he says, success lies in being in harmony with the elements of happiness such as family, friends, and health. Finally, Branson continues to believe that dreaming and boldly venturing are the shortcuts to success. For example, his adventurous spirit remains undiminished as he takes on the challenge of space travel and invests in new technology. His philosophy teaches us that success and happiness are always within reach and that we can build a more fulfilling life by embracing fun and a sense of adventure. Branson's philosophy teaches us the importance of pursuing dreams, having fun, and having fun. We continue to believe that dreams and bold adventures are the shortcut to success. His adventurous spirit never wanes and he continues to pursue new challenges in the future. Among them, there are several noteworthy projects. The first is Virgin Galactic, a space travel business. By bringing space travel to the general public, Branson aims to expand the opportunity to realize dreams and raise awareness of the global environment. This is an iconic project that takes his dream to the next level. He is also investing in new energy technologies. He strengthens his contribution to the planet through his commitment to green technology and sustainable energy. Branson is paving the way for a greener future, based on his belief that business and the environment should coexist. These projects are rooted in Branson's values that business should serve society. He not only pursues success, but also enjoys contributing to society and the planet as a whole through that success. Moreover, he has also progressed in the field of education. He recognizes the importance of education for future generations and expands opportunities for knowledge sharing and growth by providing a platform for learning. His new vision focuses on the impact that individual dreams and passions have on society as a whole. 
He believes that the power of each person can change society, and this belief injects energy into new projects. Branson's vision for the future teaches us the importance of remembering dreams, adventures, and creating new visions. His words, success is not forever. What matters is the attitude of pursuing your dreams. These words convey the importance of always finding new goals and adventures and moving toward them. We have long held the belief that business should serve society. The future business model he proposes is not just about profit-seeking, but one that fulfills our responsibilities to the earth and society. At the heart of its model are environmental considerations, investments in social aspects, and a long-term perspective. His vision is focused not only on short-term success, but also on having a positive impact on future generations. In this regard, Branson says, environmental issues are also business issues. True to his word, he also promotes environmentally friendly practices at his own company. Of particular note is the crowdfunding eco-project adopted by the Virgin Group. This allows the public to invest in projects that benefit the environment and support sustainable initiatives. His vision envisions a future where companies cooperate and grow together with society. Branson also focuses on the social aspect. Through Virgin Anchua, he develops activities that have a positive impact on local communities, including investing in local communities and supporting education. He believes that success should be shared and focuses on giving back to society from his business successes. These initiatives are presenting new business models that go beyond the boundaries of mere companies. Branson says, sustainable business is the key to opening up the future and emphasizes the importance of focusing on long-term impact rather than short-term profits. Branson's sustainable business model shows us new possibilities for business to collaborate and grow together with society and the environment. His words, environmental and social problems are business opportunities that must be solved inspire us to view challenges as business opportunities and to work towards solving them. Branson recognizes the importance of not only success, but sharing that success and passing it on to the next generation. That mindset was formed as he pursued his dreams and took on adventures from his youth. And his attitude has inspired many people. His words, success should be shared, reflect his philosophy that success in business should be shared with the community and the next generation, rather than just being personal. This attitude is part of what makes his influence so enduring. He also works to teach young people the importance of entrepreneurship and leadership. He is passionate about inspiring young people, emphasizing the importance of pursuing their dreams and developing a new generation of leaders. Branson's influence stems not only from his personal successes, but also from his positive contributions to society. His efforts include addressing environmental and social issues, proposing new business models, and striving for a more sustainable and just future. His famous quote, it's all about pursuing your dreams, is the source of his influence across generations. His attitude of pursuing his own dreams, learning from his mistakes, and continuing to take on new adventures brings courage and hope to many people. And his family has inherited that attitude. Branson's values are spreading across generations through philanthropic activities and contributions to society within the family. It's not just our success but our commitment to our families and communities that helps us continue to make an impact.